So is cortisol holding you back a stress hormone that is keeping fat on your body? That is what this commenter is one wondering. Working on tummy fat, I heard that being in pool helps with reduced cortisol levels going in the hot tub to stretch and foam dumbbells with arms and ab work. So they're doing like a hot tub workout. That's awesome. I love that. I'm not going to discourage that at all. It's the first part that I'm going to focus on, and I'm not necessarily going to discourage it. Um, but working on tummy fat, number one, you can't really work on tummy fat. There might be re emerging research that kind of shows you sort of can, but it's not much, if anything. Um, it's called like mobilizing fat stores, but I don't know if I'm buying it yet. But it says she's working on tummy fat. That is the last place that it goes. It's usually the first, it's the last place that it leaves because it's usually the first place that it, that it goes, that it comes onto the body. Um, so it could just be a stubborn, you know, air, the reason they call it stubborn fat is because it's, it's the last little bit of fat. The last little bit of fat is always the hardest. If the last little bit of fat was on your arms, that would be the hardest. Um, so maybe just a patience thing, but also this part, I heard that being in the pool helps with reduced cortisol levels. I'm guessing that she's implying that cortisol is the reason that the tummy fat is staying because cortisol has been, you know, people love to blame hormones specifically for belly fat. Um, and that's just not, that's not going to be true. Cortisol, um, is a very useful hormone, um, does lots of uh, cool things like allowing you whenever you intermittent fast, um, to run off of, uh, less energy and stuff like that. Um, and it's very important for, for our bodies to have it. I won't get into it too much, but, um, sure. Being in a pool can help reduce cortisol levels, but your reduced cortisol levels, you know, cause you're probably going to be enjoying yourself. You're, you're relaxing a little bit more. And of course that's going to be good. Reduce your stress. I'm not saying that's not going to, that is so going to help with your, with your weight loss, but the main problem could be calories. You know, um, if she's stressed, she could be eating more if she's, you know, and maybe getting in the pool helps her to relax and eat less. So that would result in weight loss, but it is not the cortisol level drop that's necessarily directly involved in the weight loss. Um, so she's going to need to, uh, eat less calories and I mean, maybe not even eat less calories. Maybe, you know, there's so many things that, you know, I can't really tell from a comment, but she needs to be lifting weight two, two times a week at least. Um, and then she needs to be keeping track of her calories, make sure she's not cheating on her diet too hard on the weekends and, or anything. And, you know, relaxing is good and reducing your cortisol levels is good, but that's not going to be the thing that does it. It's going to be exercise and eating right and all that classic stuff that we know we need to do. Um, and, and she's not reducing her, um, her responsibility to those things. That's not what I'm saying, but, um, that is, uh, what, what needs to happen for her, the, the pool isn't going to help much. It'll help a little bit. And it, if it fits into your routine, then that is certainly, you know, if you like working out and then going to the sauna and then going to the pool um, or like the hot tub or whatever to kind of like reduce that inflammation, by all means, go for it. It's not going to hurt. And if it reduces your stress and gets you in the groove of, I really like being at the gym because afterwards I get to sit in the hot tub or whatever, then that is going to give you a win. And that's going to be a big thing. But I just wouldn't worry too much about this particular situation of the pool reducing cortisol levels. I have an awesome free resource for you that is called the 30 day shape up challenge. It's 30 days of four habits that I run my clients through that is going to help you get a great start to your fat loss journey. And there's a bonus fifth habit in case you fall off the wagon at all. All my clients love it and it's free. So just scan this QR code here or click the link in the description and I'll send that straight to your email.